everybody in the booth today because I'm mad at them for making me go on the sun yesterday. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. On the bench and I think Listen, if Lisa way. McCree oh. can wear it on Good Morning America, I can wear it on Home and Family. Yeah, well, look, 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 look how well Good Morning America is doing. Well, they're changing. <laughs> and it's my show. Well, it's, okay. it's not, uh, you know, they made a change and we'll see what happens. <laughs> She's still wearing white. That's great. Hey, you know what? What's that? I am really very happy. We have a whole house full of guests. We're going to do proms. We're going to cook like we do every day. But this lady is very special. I've known her for a lot of years. And she's, you meet her, she's very simpatico. You want to take her home and keep her. Born or love. Well, that's not yeah. <laughs> In some states, that's called kidnapping, well, so I think I you should define what you mean by that. No, you meet her and you feel like you've known her all your life, but she's just... You she's have. She's I have. Yeah, I have, tragically. <laughs> and you're starring in a new movie, My Giant, with Billy Crystal? Yeah, I have a part in that. It was bigger. It was, it now was. it's not. Uh, <laughs> the Giant. The Giant takes it. Yeah. Okay. What did you do in the movie? Oh, I had a whole song and a scene and, and everything, and... Now it's not there. Oh, I went to oh please, the check cleared. Okay. <laughs> okay. Who cares? I went to go Who see cares? it. I went to go see it, and I didn't see as much of you as I thought I would. <laughs> Me neither. <Yeah. laughs> Show a little piece of this. Uh, it's the movie with Billy Crystal, My Giant, for all of us. My biggest thrill is discovering someone special and taking them as far as they can go. Like my new singer, who, trust me, is going to be the next Whitney Houston. Nissan is the car that you love to drive, that you love to drive. All right, so the auto show isn't exactly Carnegie Hall, but if you want to make it in show business, you got to pay your dues. <laughs> No, no, it was a big long scene and everything, and I'll tell you all about it later. Okay. And and and, and, and about the book. And yeah, my well, book. The book is chock full of wonderful memories of you growing up and disappointments that you've had along the way yeah. and your career. Is this going to end up in the other book? Your disappointment and over this movie? Um, in, in part two? Yeah. <laughs> if Billy plays his cards right, it won't. Okay. Okay, that's great. Welcome to the show. Thanks. Yeah. It's nice to have you here, Warren. Right. Oh, by the way. What's that? I meant to say that, that Warren and I share something in common. Remember, you reminded me this morning in the oh. session, which made me just shudder at the thought. Do you want to explain to everybody what well, that was? When I was pregnant with my daughter, uh, Christina came to a baby shower, and she proceeded to tell me this unbelievable story about this anesthesiologist in the hospital and she told me this really horrific story about what had happened to her and Tony and I said gee that's really awful and then she told me the gentleman's name and I said oh sure enough I got the same guy. Oh. <laughs> the thing was that, that when we were in, the, I was in labor forever, and the anesthesiologist stayed with me the whole time. He was there like right. 26 hours, and I'm and I'm pushing and I'm shoving, and, I, and, and then if I finally get the epidural, I get some relief, and just as the baby starts to and come out, in that wonderful vulnerable yeah. position, <laughs> one arm on my knee, and he looked at one hand on the hip, and he looks at Tony. Now this start, starting to wear off, and he goes. You know, Tony, I have this script that I wrote. <laughs> and he said, I'd like for you to read it. And my husband, like, you know, he he, get, he goes, no. And I went, I'll read it. I'll read it. I'll make him do the movie. Oh, yeah, you know, and I thought to myself, I thought to myself, if this guy says one thing about a singing lesson, I'll give him anything he wants. But I'm not. But I said, I'll make him do the movie. Just give me more juice. You know, it was like, it's 
a true story. And Woody was the one who ended up taking me to the hospital. So how did that day start? I'm okay. The, I'm the real father. You are the real yeah. father. All right. Wow. Hey, you know, what? Are, yesterday, yeah. uh, we did on the show. We told you about the tape, your own Mr. Bill adventure contest. Remember? Sure. Oh, well, after the show yesterday, we taped our very own Mr. Bill adventure, and here's a sneak preview. Give me some ideas of what, what you can do on your own. Wrong. <laughs> Did you want to say something? No. Did you go to yours? 
Yes, I did. I went with Remember Bill Small. Oh, Remember right. Bill? Yeah. And Bill didn't know how to dance at all through high school. We never went to any of the dances because Bill didn't know how to dance. <laughs> And the night of the prom... What did you do instead? The, 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 the <laughs> <laughs> I think Bye. 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 Twister was big that one. Oh, wait a minute. She's being real quiet here. I think there's something good here. I'm just going to let that go. <laughs> no, um, I'm You're trying to think. Oh, uh, no, yes, I'm just turning 18. Turn the model? Oh, I was modeling before that, but 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 that, he, the first dance, the first slow dance that came on, he he asked me for my hand and took me out to the dance floor. I said, "Well, he doesn't know how to dance," and he took dancing lessons, so he would be able to look, to dance with me that night. So I never forgot that. Boy, Do you remember? Right yeah, boy, it sure was. You should see Bill now. We had him. They surprised me on the show with Bill uh -huh. to die. Oh, he's so is he gray? He's, he's, right. No, he's so gorgeous and has mucho dinero. Wow. Oh, oh, man. Big bucks. Well, right? not like you need to trade up. Well. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing all right, aren't you? I always take care of me. I don't need a man. First. Oh, anyway. Oh, okay, here wow. we go. That's a whole other show. You want to get a number now? <laughs> also get Vita on the phone. Tell her she's got a booking. Vita. <laughs> I rule my world. Yeah, what I need? I need my fruit. Kita K is here. She's author of the book, The Fountain of Youth Diet. Welcome back. Here. <laughs> On a couple, uh, about a month and a half ago, got a great response. Thought I'd bring it back. Cause you, look, so much. you look five years younger yeah, and uh, 20,000. Hey, she said, you were here a month ago. What is, you know, how bad can it be? It was actually two weeks, but who cares? Thank you. What is the Fountain of Youth? The Fountain of Youth is absolutely the hottest new diet in America today. Not only do you lose weight on the Fountain of Youth, guys, but you get younger. Remember the skin pinch test we did? Mm -hmm. Okay, to show us how old we are? Well, now we're reversing that today. Do you want to know what it is? Show the mommies. Oh, know what it is. You put your hand down right now. You pinch your skin, you hold it, and then... <laughs> No, no, you won't. You won't. No. You look like you have great skin. You hold your skin up, and then when you let it go, you count for it. And as long as it's it takes it down, down, that's how old your skin is. That's how old? Does it have, like, different years? Well, no, no. For every second, years? no. Okay, hold it up. <laughs> okay, hold it up. Okay, hold it up. Let go. One, look at perfect. You know what you are? You're about 22. <gasps> oh, <laughs> Doing that, they couldn't even get the skin off. They could not even get their skin off. Oh, it's so depressing. <laughs> they, were, they were trying to pull it, nothing would yeah. come off. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, oh my God. God. Carol, back with <laughs> Carol. <laughs> Carol Sturman's on my disc is young Carol yeah. Sturman's high. Carol, what are you doing today? Today we're going to go through a, transform a transformation. Every house never has enough frames, and the rage now are the brushed steel frames, which really can be very, very pricey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we're going to change this into this just using just pretty fat aluminum foil. See? Wow. Inexpensively, I would bet. Inexpensive. Oh, that's oh, Do you, I want to show you. Can I just show you something? What? Turn around and face this way. Can you see the monitor over here? Okay, get a shot of Lorna. Get a shot of Lorna. Okay. Now put the shot of Lorna up. Okay, now see how nice she looks, the, the lighting? Now get a nice tight shot of Christina. Can you the light? No, no, watch what happens to you. Take a shot of Christina. Look how dark you are. Why am I watch dark? out because... This. You hate the white. Look at all. Okay, I'm just trying to make it look good. Don't pick on her. Yeah, he's picking on me. Don't pick on me. Look at her. He's picking on me. No, I'm not picking on you. Marty, go grab another jacket. It's going to be a problem. All right? Breathe the crossover, take a big swim, and they'll lick you. Hey, tonight is the uh, Academy of Country Music Awards right here at Universal. It's put on by CBS. It airs at 8 o'clock. And I'm going to actually go. To the Country Music Academy, Country Music Awards tonight. I, I like it. Why are you like it? <laughs> I left my car. And lost my dog. I like it. Anyway, yes, you're too big to get over. Answer the phone for me. Uh, yesterday at the uh, Country Star Restaurant, yeah. all the um, nominees met all the press, and we took the crew. Did you get the tape? Yeah, oh. we got some of that. So Can we see that little. Oh, I see it now. Take a breath. Right. A little later in the show, okay. we're going to show you what I did over at Cuffy Star, and then tonight I'll go, and then I'll report on what happened. Do you think Lorna Luft would like the email music? 
Yo, who doesn't like Vino Medina? Maybe. Fire it up. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody stand up. Let's see. Follow the bouncing head. Go, baby. Here we go. Fire some music. Yeah, Bobby. 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 Bobby.